my voice. Um, so I got my package today. I placed the order Friday, I believe it was. It would have came Monday. That's what it had informed me. But because it was Memorial Day, um, it got moved over to today. So let's get started with the haul because I know that's what a lot of you that just entered are probably like wanting to know. So I did get several. Let's see. I got three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I got ten baked eyeshadow powders. And the packaging, everything came out. Wait, hold on. I, I just. Oh, really? It's okay, Nelly. I mean, one cancels, but you're going to get plenty of more, especially because it's prom season still, I'm pretty sure. Um, <laughs> pretty in pink. Um, okay, so I got some of the baked powders i got mostly colors that i don't have in like my other palettes and the reason why is because i want to go out of my comfort zone and i want to do different types of looks and these are just colors that i have not found in a palette like i don't know i rather get single shadows and do like my own palette like maybe depot them and make my own palette than actually pay like so much money or a good amount of money and I'm not even going to use like half the shadows in that palette. Oh and then yeah you guys I have no makeup on because after this I'm actually going to be filming a makeup tutorial video or like two or three since I have free time today so ignore please. Um, okay so first one and it sucks because it doesn't have like the name like on the website it'll show you like the name but on um, this one it's just the number so the first one I got is like this silver i can't even open it one second is the silver gray one it's really well really 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 pretty it's shiny i'm in love with this color this isn't out of my comfort zone because i love like silver but i wanted to try try them out why am i stirring so much and these are wet dry baked powders so you can use them wet or you can use them dry and i will be swatching them wet and i will be swatching them dry so let's and then the next one i got oh and then that was number 11 so that was like the silver number 11. what i have noticed is like a lot of things are starting to like like be sold out so this is another website where like you have to just get there as quick as you can to buy everything and purchase it um i do like it better than shop miss a i feel like it has better products well from what i was able to test out already um and i love the shipping the ship like with shop miss a i had to wait almost like a week and a half and with jb and eves it was like two days two three days shipping and i didn't even have to pay and also another thing is if you spend ten dollars or more you get free shipping and with shop miss a you have to spend like about i believe it's 35 so almost close to 40 dollars just to get free shipping or else you have to pay like well for me um i live in california i have to pay about seven dollars for shipping or for shipping and that's like seven more things that i can get with those seven dollars so the next one i got is this Mm, like I want to say navy blue but not really navy blue like teal blue kind of um this is number 12 so pretty it is Nelly they're so beautiful I'm so happy that I got these like some these are some colors that I have not seen in other palettes and then the next one I got, um, when I saw this color, it automatically reminded me of my mom because she loves this color. Like, this is one of her favorite colors. And it's this, ugh, let me open it. It closed on me. It's this beautiful, like, not neon yellow, but in, like, person, it's like a bright yellow. And you guys, it's so hard to find a yellow that actually, like, stands out. This is number seven. I just don't remember the names. I should have written them down. I thought they were going to come with the packaging, but it doesn't. It's just the numbers. And then, did I get two of the same ones? Oh, okay. Okay, so then this is the next one. This is number 19. 
And I know this one looks similar to the other one, but I promise you they are not. There's actually a difference. One's darker and one's like lighter. Let me put them. You can see this one's darker and this one's way lighter. So this is 12 and this is 19. So pretty. I haven't even swatched them yet, so. And then I got a couple more. So let's see, because I don't want to be skipping you guys' messages. Yes, Nelly, they're so beautiful. I was so happy when when I saw that when I saw them on the website, I was like, oh my gosh. I need to try these out because I was going to get where is it from? I don't know if it was from Shop Miss A. Hi Vern! Just the makeup haul. <laughs> um I was going to get I think it was from Shop Miss A, but like majority of them were sold out and I was like, man, I wish that yeah, I'm live. I'm doing a live. Finally have a little bit of time, so I just decided Oh, wait, hold on, Elliot, on to you right now. Um, I just decided to do it, like, kind of quick because I am going to film videos after this. And thank you, Nelly. Um, <laughs> wow, Vern. You're going to get some makeup tips um, and websites to purchase. Um, Nelly, my background, actually, going, this is, like, part of another video that I'm going to do. But I'll just give you guys, like, a little, um, what do you say, like, a little... Not tip, but like, I don't know how to say it, but I'll just, okay. Um, so I went out to run errands one day. Actually, my honey sent me out to run errands one day. Um, this was, uh, I believe, it was Saturday, Sunday. Um, since the morning. Like, he literally sent me here and there and over there. And, like, I was gone, like, all day. And I come back, and he surprised me with pretty much an upgraded vanity I know I was going to do a um, affordable upgraded vanity but you guys he surprised me so um, from what I see it is pretty affordable still but I just I didn't get to do it he did it for me and he's the sweetest so my love if you're watching this thank you so much I love you and I can't wait to share with you guys everything that he did which is amazing I was just like in shock even the lighting like look you guys literally watch I'm going to Hi, Bren Brenda. Okay, so I'm like bright and then I'm gonna get dark. And then I'm gonna get bright. Like, you, I'm pretty sure some of you already know what it is, but I'm gonna do a separate video on that. And then he surprised me with my background, so ah, I love it. Um, what eyeshadow was that? Okay, oh wait, I need to answer you guys' comments. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to do this like as quick as I can before my baby need something okay let's see um <laughs> oh my gosh Vern, you're so funny okay um so the next one i got was like this gold yeah i'll say gold um eyeshadow i thought it was like a yellowish it's like a yellowish gold but this reminds me of like um Oh, I know. Finally, huh? I finally go on live. It's been a while. He wants to be? Yeah, I'm going to have to make this quick because he's going to need his mama soon already. Um. Okay, so then this is like a gold, like gold, goldish yellow. I love this color. When I opened it and I saw it, I was like, oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. This is number 22. He's going to start throwing his off temper tantrums he is two years old so he's in those terrible twos and if i'm looking this way it's because i can see him even though i know i have a it looks like i have a big background but i can i can see him very good from here so just gotta keep an eye on him what are you doing okay um so the next one see this is where i think i got the same ones but no i didn't although these kind of look similar so let me open this so this is the first one that I showed you guys that was like the silver and then this is the other one and I do see like the comparison this one is lighter this one is slightly darker just a bit 
And this is 11, and this is number 21. And then I'll put them side by side. So one's definitely darker, the other one's like more lighter. Although right now that I just barely saw the packaging, they look like they were both about the same. Yeah, it is. It's really pretty. I have to work on that. I have so many videos that I have to work on. But I was just super, super busy these past couple of days. But now I'm like making time again for my videos. Um, then this next one is, let's see, okay, okay, this is number 13, and it's like a fuchsia hot pink, and I just love the color, like, it's so beautiful. And this is number 13, and you guys, all these eyeshadows were a dollar. That's what I forgot to mention. That there is some pro um, some products on that website that are more than a dollar. But seriously, like I was so happy when I found this website because the chinita like of my street, she w she had some of these products that I saw on this website, and she was selling it to me for like way more. So I'm like, okay, I'm not gonna buy from you. Okay, um, I was like, ah, oh, let me zoom in. You see, you guys can see, like, it's not that big. I have to zoom in again. Oh, my gosh. How do I zoom in here? Hold on, guys. One sec. I, like, disconnected me. Maybe if I take out the messages. Okay, there we go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's too close. Yeah. Oh my gosh, how do I zoom out? <laughs> Sorry, you guys. I'm having a little bit of trouble with the phone. That's like perfect for an eye tutorial. Okay, did I get it? No. Maybe I gotta do it from here. Oh my goodness. One sec, guys. Okay, how do I get rid of the messages? Okay, let's... I should have just like... Why can't I zoom out? Please zoom in. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay. I think I got it. I think I got it. Okay. All right, I got it. We are back. Now I need to show all these messages. Let's see. You have a, vi a video right now? Ooh, can't wait to watch it. I have free time today, so I need to catch up on, like, so many videos that I have on my ad to watch later. There's, like, a huge list. But, okay, um, was the pink one the last one that I showed you guys before this phone went all malfunctioning on me. Um, I don't want to re-show you guys it again, but let's see. Okay, so I think it was the last one. Okay. Um, so then this next one was this like, not emerald green, but in the picture it looks it was going to be emerald green but still I'm not disappointed I love the color it's really really pretty this is number 16 and it's really gorgeous like even in like what's the website oh, okay this it's JB JB Eves or JB and Eves 
I think it was JB Eves. I typed in JB and Eves, and um, it took me to that website. So I believe it's JB and Eves. I'm pretty sure Google will know what you're talking about when you type it in Google. Um, okay, so then this is the last. Girl, at least the B is not cheap. <laughs> I know that was so funny. <laughs> I was laughing. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it was it was really funny. Um, let's see. What was I gonna say? I just lost my train of thought. And then I'm just trying to keep an eye on this little boy. Okay. Um. So the next one. This was the last of the baked eyeshadow powder, eyeshadow wet dry powders that I got. And this is like to me, it was like a sapphire blue, which is gorgeous. So here is the blue. I know it looks kind of purple, but it's not. It's a blue. Very, very pretty. You can see like it has a little bit of shimmer. This is number 20. I wish they would have had the names in the back. What I am also going to see is like maybe if I can depot it. But since it's pretty, it comes pretty um, like chunky thick I don't know what palette or how it would make a palette yes I just oh yeah I know I like mattes though so do this oh Bre I'm sorry Brenda I'm sorry that I skipped your message let's see okay um so yeah that was the last one and all of these were 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 oh my gosh I can't even talk today I have my list right here I'm just trying to open it all of these were one dollar um okay so now let's move on to there's two more things on here that I'm so excited to try out you guys like oh my goodness I'm so excited and I'm probably going to be filming the look right after this video. But for those of you that just came on, I'm just doing a live because I don't have much memory on my SD card. So I have to get rid of some stuff and then I'll be able to record the next couple of videos. But these next two things, these are the two things that I was that I saw the Chinita of my street selling, trying to sell to me. And when I saw the price online for these, I was like, oh my gosh, is it the same one? And when the packaging came today, I was like, welcome to doctor's club. Hi, Shopkins. Oh, I hope everything goes good at the doctor's. Take care. Um, when I saw this, I was just, you guys, I was like, oh. <laughs> Okay, so what, should I save it for last or should I show you guys right now? You know what? I'm gonna save it for last. <laughs> um, I'll just I just have two more things. It's a good idea to do a live. I know. Yeah, Brenda, I do use a lot of my memory, especially because, like I've mentioned in my previous videos, I do have a toddler, and he's constantly asking for my attention. Like in the beginning of the the live, he was already starting to ask for my attention. Right now, he's just playing with his toys. So if you hear like a little bit of noise in the back, it's just him playing with his toys. And, um, yeah, sometimes I just decide to do live and then I can also chat with you guys so if you guys have any questions because I know some of you have commented on my videos asking me several questions and I don't get back to you on time and I feel so bad. So that's why I just chose to do a live today, especially because these are new products and I just want to, um, I lost my train of thought. I just want to share with you guys and then we could chit chat a little bit since I do have some free time. Um... I don't know if I should do the swatches. I'm from Cali, Brenda. Um, I don't know if I should do the swatches right now on live or if I should just do a video on that. Um, but okay. So the next three things. Sorry, I thought I got two things. The next thing I got was this Cara lip liner. And this is in Dark Salmon. And like nudes and like these colors, I love, I live for those, like oh my gosh. And this was actually 75 cents. So they have plenty of different colors. Um, they have like blue, red, uh, baby blue, they have a purple, like I wanted to get more but I only got one because I wanted to try out the formula. And I am going to, um, let's see, test this out on my hand. Oh, that is soft. 
Okay, so I don't know if you guys could see it, but, and it's like just, and it's true to color. It really is. That's so pretty. Should I add more light? There we go. Just add a little bit more light. So these are 75 cents on the website. Definitely, definitely recommend you guys to get them. And then this is something that I saw that I wanted to try out because I did own the, I believe it was Mika, Mika Beauty Cosmetics one. And it is the, this is the Nobby 2-in-1 Mascara with Fibers. So I guess step one would be like you just like prime your eye with the mascara. And then step two is the like little fake lashes and as you brush it. It literally like extends them. I haven't tried this one, but I have tried the no um the Nobby, the Mika Beauty one, and I love it. Um, fortunately, I don't have it anymore. I ran out of it, and it is pretty pricey. Um, so I just decided to pick this up to see if maybe this could be a um, affordable alternative to that one. And I will try this out in the full tutorial video. So I'll let you guys know how it worked, of course, and then. Okay, so a lot of you have asked me too, what is the liquid liner that I use in my videos? The liquid liner that I'm using in a lot of my tutorial videos, and I had it out too, but my son gets everything. One sec. Oh my gosh, everything's just falling. Actually, I think he got it. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, so I have two right now, and they're both super affordable. Like, you don't even know how like affordable they are. And I always get compliments everywhere I go. They always ask me, oh my gosh, what liner are you wearing? Like, I love your eyeliner. Um, and it is actually, it's been between, it's the LA Colors Liquid Eyeliner. And you guys, this one's at the Dollar Tree. That's where I, I bought so many of these because I loved it. The wand is so like thin and like flexible it's super thin like look how thin that is and it works for me and I, I'm I love it so much and then the other one that sometimes when I want to go a little bit more like I guess say not dramatic but like I want it more matte but I want it like more bold um, I go with the AOA wonder liquid liner and these two together is amazing. Just the only thing is that the AOA one, I've only seen it in Shop Miss A. So you would have to order it from Shop Miss A. And like I said, free shipping for $35. If you're going to buy a good amount of things, then, you know, that's cool. But if you're just going to buy, like, 10 things, you're going to have to pay, like, $7. Or wherever you are, shipping's different, I believe, in every, like, in different states. Um, you're gonna have to pay like a price and then that's what you can use to buy like seven other things, you know So I wanted to give this one a try which is the she matte eyeliner And I haven't even opened it. So actually let me open this um, Let's see. Oh, this is a thick wand I don't like thick wands Yes, Brenda, I do not like paying shipping either. Let's see Okay, so it's pretty dark. Ooh. So, let's see if you guys can see it. It's pretty dark. It looks like it has a little bit of shimmer. Just a teeny bit. It says it dries matte. So maybe what I will do is I'll take, like, one of the wands from here, like an old one that's finished already, just wash it, clean it, and then just use it for this one. Um, I'm gonna wait for it to dry and see if it really does dry now. Shouldn't take too long. Okay, so then that's all of those three products. Let's see. Oh, it dried already. And it doesn't even smear. Wow. Oh, wait, but it is like... Obviously, if you're gonna do it with your nail... Ah. Oh, you left pretty and pink. I didn't even know. Did they get... Did you get in trouble at work for watching my video? <laughs> So, obviously, if you scratch it with your nail. Oh, hi, Vern. 
Um, if you scratch it with your nail, it is ah, it is gonna come off. But once I place it on my um, hand and I just let it dry, like like what was it like 10, 20 seconds? It dried and I went like that. And it didn't smear. So for smearing, it's good. For the application, okay. Bye, pretty and pink. Don't get in trouble. Um. For the, like the wand, it's really thick, and I don't like thick wands. I don't, I can't work with them that good. So the wand, I don't recommend using that one unless you're really good at, you know, using the thick ones. But the um, the product itself, like, it doesn't smear, and I love an eyeliner that doesn't smear and that dries quick like that. All right, you guys. So this is the final two products that. I'm pretty sure you guys have been waiting for. Um, like, you guys, I just, I can't stop staring at it. It's just, it's amazing. So, the number one is, but these weren't a dollar. I just don't think they were. Let me actually try. No, okay. But it's still affordable. It's still really affordable because I'm going to tell you guys the price the, the Chinita that she was trying to sell it to me for. And I was like, no, I'm not going to pay that much. Um, so this is the Santi Pro Finish 12 color eyeshadow palette and this is, um, does it have like a golden, this is golden, does it say it in the front? No, but it's back here. And then these are the colors it has and they do have names which, so happy. And I'm going to open it of course, I'm going to show you guys. Maybe this one I will do swatches um right now and honestly like the packaging it does come with its plastic let me take off the plastic so you guys because sometimes the plastic mess messes up the color of the eyeshadows so here it is you guys that is so pretty so oops i'm not gonna use that but okay so it has three four five it looks like it has five mattes and Three, four, five, and five shimmers or sat satins. They look kind of. They look like on both. Um, for those of you wondering, this is not tested on animals, and the ingredients are in the back of everything that it contains. And the chin. Oh, six. Ah, you guys. Sorry, I'm sorry if I like hurt your ears. Six steps to dazzling eyes. That's cool. <laughs> um, okay, so let's see. It, he got excited too. <laughs> um, so it does have. Puppy, I'm trying to record. I'm trying to record. Can you let me record? Okay, guys. Um, so it does have, oh, sorry. It does have like steps to create a look, but you can honestly, you can do so many looks with these colors. Okay. So the Chinita, um, up my street was trying to sell me this for $10. This one was, no. $12? 12, 10 or $12, which I was like, mm. I was like, I don't know, because normally Santi isn't, you know, that pricey, but when I went to go look on the website, jb and and I saw this, this was only $4.49, $4.49, and she was trying to sell it to me for $10. I mean, I know that people got to make their money, but I mean, I'm so happy that I found this good deal and I'm going to swatch a couple. I'm just going to do like a random swatch. I haven't swatched them yet, so. <laughs> Hi, baby. Let's do, what color should we swatch? Let's do this. I'm going to do two mattes and two satins or shimmers. That's what it looks like. And you, it looks like you can easily depot them as well. So if you don't want to keep them in this palette. But personally, I love this palette. It's a pretty good size. And it's, it doesn't even like 
feel like cheap it feels real good like packaging so all right let's do let's do cappuccino because cap oh you guys these are soft wow that's oh i'm sorry i'm not even showing you guys okay so we're gonna do and it just smells like regular eyeshadow we're gonna do cappuccino and i'm trying to swatch in so we'll just do little swatches let's see so I can see it in my mirror, but I don't know if you guys will be able to see it. It's this is like a nudie. You know what? Let me try to do it on my arm. And this is without primer, so and it doesn't actually it does not have much fallout. Let's go with let's go with some bright colors. Let's do this blue. Let's do this blue. Whoa. That's actually quite a lot. No, it just doesn't have fall out. So that's the blue. And that's just finger swatch. So I'm going to do it right here. This is the letter M. So it's not. On camera, it doesn't look that bright. But in the, like in person. Oh my gosh, that's a horrible place to swatch. That is a horrible place to swatch. <laughs> Let me swatch here. So that would be better. And this is without a primer, so they do kind of look a little patchy. What do I care? Yeah, they do look patchy, although it does look um, light on camera, but in person it's actually pretty dark. Just that I think I have too much light. Let me like lower my light a bit. So that's the blue. And then I lose my finger. You could definitely work with it, so that's like not a problem, but I mean I like it. It doesn't have much fallout. Oh my gosh, it's just you can't I'm gonna try to zoom in. It's out there, like you can see it and like this nudie one. It's right there too. So they're not too too out there. But it works. Or maybe I just didn't swatch it good. I don't know. That's That was like the second swatch after. Let's do some shimmers. Let's see how shimmers are. Let's see. I'm just going to clean it off with my wipe real quick. Oh, I took off some of the blue. Oops. Sorry. Okay, let's do... Let's do that sunset because that sunset is just calling my name. Okay, so that's how it is when I swatch it. And then... Or when I finger swatch. So now let's do it here. And then I don't have a primer, so... Okay, so that one's actually... A bit better. That's pretty. That's super pretty. You can actually tell that. Wow. Okay. All right. I see you. How do they do that one thing? How it goes? I can't do it. Okay. And let's do. Let's do glam. Let's do glam. I think once you put it with like a primer, it's actually going to look much better so it is something you can work with oh that was a bad swatch now <laughs> now i gotta do a sunset look hi jenny how was your party oh my gosh so the the mats aren't this one right here this is a shimmer this one is sunset <laughs> That's sunset. The colors are really pretty. What I was thinking is maybe I should like put a primer. I'm probably going to do it on this one then. I'm going to put primer. Like just a little bit of eye primer. And then I'm going to swatch so we can see how. But I know that 
some of the colors or sometimes like some eyeshadow even if you swatch it on your hands or your like um wrists whatever when you put it on your eyes it doesn't like it comes out more it shows way more so that's you know you got to be careful um i am still gonna do a look with these so don't worry let me get some eye primer I'm gonna do my off one because I love my off one. Oh wait, I think somebody commented. Hi Rosa Princess, welcome to my channel. How are you doing? Wait, are you new or have you been here? Oh my gosh, my freak my like Okay, you guys can see my baby hairs. Let's cover those baby hairs. Alright, so I'm gonna do the so hard. I'm gonna do the the eye primer right here. And we're going to see if maybe that makes a difference. I know this is eye primer, but oh well. It's okay. Let's just blend it out. I am cleaning my house. I keep processing and watching. Oh really? I I need to clean a bit actually too. Maybe just still uploading. Brenda, yeah, uh, I will be uploading today. Well, since I did the today's video, which video do you guys want to see? Do you guys want me? To, do you guys want to see the swatches of the baked powders? Do you guys want me to do a look, or do you guys want to see what my honey surprised me with? I am new from oh thank you so much for coming to my channel you guys hashtag I am a creator that is awesome like all the positivity that they give on there it's amazing and it's if you search it up on like um, YouTube you type in James Cox he's the one that does the live streams and you meet like so many awesome people on there I want to see like how much I have this. <laughs> okay. Um, I'll do the look. I'll do the look and then maybe tomorrow I'll do what my hubby surprised him with. I have to see because if I have the time to do the look, then I'll do the look. If not, then I'll just do what my hubby surprised me with so you guys can see. Um, but real quick about hashtag I'm a creator. Like I have met so many awesome people on there. And it's not, I know maybe some of you have heard that maybe it's like, oh, you go on and you tell people to support you or to sub subscribe to you and like your subscribers will go up. But no, it's nothing like that. It's more like you, you're like, they're giving the chance to small YouTubers to get put out there. But it's not just a sub for sub because I have gotten quite a lot of sub for subs and it's like if i'm not interested in your channel i'm not going to watch it i don't just want to be a i guess you could say like not i'm the lonely um like i don't just want to subscribe to you and then that's just it like not go back and watch your videos and actually support you so hashtag i well hashtag i am creator you go on like a live stream with james cox and Vern. if you're on here Vern. <laughs> Oh, sorry. If you're on here, Vern, say hey. I'm trying to talk about something important here. Thank you. Um, and yeah, they do live streams, and you get to you get to chit you get to chit chat, you get to communicate, you get to meet new people. It's a positive community. It's so awesome. I'm so so happy and thankful that Shopkins, she's also on here, um, told me about it, and BB, someone else that I don't think she's on here today. She's probably working. Um, but they informed me about it, and I gave it a try, and I loved it, and it's just awesome. Um, they do a live stream. I'm probably going to have to do a whole other video on this. <laughs> Silly. Um, they do a live stream on Saturdays. Yeah, on Saturdays. Um, I go on around 3 p.m. Pacific time. I'm not, I forgot what um, Eastern and all the other times. But 
every time I go on, it's 3 p.m. here in um, California. Oh, you did? I didn't see her live. She went live today? I didn't see it. Um, but yeah, every time it's 3 p.m. here in California, the stream is already going. And it's Creator Thon. This is Creator Thon 6. Is yesterday? Wait. What are you guys talking about? Oh, you're talking about BB. Okay. Um, so, yeah, real quick to just, like, wrap this up and then I can continue to this. Um, so, you, I definitely, definitely recommend you guys to go check it out. You guys will love it. And it's just a heads up. It's not a sub for sub. So, if your channel, if you're barely starting your channel and you just want to, like, gain subscribers like that, but you're just doing literally, like, sub for sub, it's not going to work out for you. Um, that's not what... Hashtag I'm a creator is about and you you meet so many awesome people I've met so many of you from there and I'm so thankful that you guys came and checked out my channel And now we're just like we're talking like if we've known each other for like a long time So definitely definitely recommend you guys to go check out James Cox subscribe to him and just check out his streams you can go ahead and you don't have to watch the whole thing because they are about eight hours long it's like a full-time shift literally and it's so sweet that both Vern and James are taking time out and other um people also in there they're taking their time out of their day when they could obviously be doing something else to come you know do this stream and help out so many of us so many of us small youtubers so thank you thank you so much you guys um and definitely definitely recommend you guys to go check it out i thought Vern was on i'm pretty sure he was on Vern, are you there he probably had to go but okay. oh i missed some comments i'm so sorry let's see let's go up. um Oh, her live was yesterday, um, Jenny. Sorry, I was going to call you BB. Okay, so, all right, you guys, so let's finish this. The primer looks like it already set in. Can't even tell I'm wearing any primer, but I did. So now let's do the swatches with the primer. See if maybe that makes a difference. So let's do, I'm going to go back with that blue because I have hopes for navy. That's the color. Navy looks very pretty. Where did I put the primer? Okay, so let's see. Oh, okay, okay, we're getting somewhere. Okay, so it's definitely came out way darker. Oh, sorry. Where is it? I can't. Okay. It definitely came out way darker. So that's without a primer. That's with the primer. So you guys, these eyeshadows are. What do you say? Manageable. <laughs> They're manageable. So. I definitely I would recommend this palette. There's a very a lot of pretty colors on here. Really pretty. Actually, you can create a like a good amount of looks with this. So that blue is a little bit um has a little bit of fallout, but it's okay. Nothing too bad. So this is the Santi Pro Finish 12 color eyeshadow palette. And it does have the names. I can't even. It does have the names under each shadow, which is so cool. I love those type of palettes. Okay, and then this is the last one. Oh, Jenny, I got this from JB and Eve's website. Um, that's. Yeah, let me see if it's on here. It's JB and Eves. If, when you go on Google, just type in JB and Eves, and if nothing pops up, type in JB Eves. Um, it's a do it's another dollar website like Shop Missé. It's honestly it's awesome. I got all these products that I've been mentioning from there, and shipping is just like two to three days, and you get your product like you get your package in like real fast. And if you spend more than ten dollars, you get free shipping. So it's way better than Shop Miss Day. Instead of spending thirty five dollars and getting free shipping, you if you just want to like try out their products, like pick out ten things, and hey, there you go, and then you get your free shipping, which is awesome. I definitely recommend that website. Hi Rosa, how are you doing? Um, definitely, definitely recommend that website and this palette. I do recommend it. You just have to, you know, work around it. As you, some of you saw, this right here is without a primer. 
this is with the primer so it's actually darker and then this one right here is without primers so imagine with primers Oof, it's gonna be real pretty so the last thing that I got from JB and Eve's that I was so excited about yeah JB and Eve's um the last thing that I got was oh it's not even opened one sec thought I opened everything Oh my gosh, I can't even... Okay, there we go. Sorry guys, I thought I had opened that one. Okay, so it is this palette and this is this one. Oh, real quick. Have any glittery eyeshadows today? Are you talking to me or to Jenny Rosa? Um... This one is was $4.49, so this was the most expensive thing that I did purchase from there. <laughs> okay, Jenny. Bye. Take care. Um, and then this one was... Oh. <laughs> um, glittery eyeshadows. This palette has... It looks like they're shimmer... You know what? No, I think they're more like satin. But they are like a little bit like this one right here. Um, this one's sunset. But when I swatched them, it didn't even look it didn't even look like it has any shimmer. I think it's just or are they metallic? I, I don't know because they could be a little bit of both. But glittery, glittery no, I, I don't have glitter glitter today. Um, are you talking glitter like the the Glitterati palette? Like that type? Okay, so I got this one that is the nude. It's called Nude Palette. Okay, um, I did get two palettes, but it's not from that website. I am going to be doing a review on it because... Um, I forgot who messaged me. Somebody messaged me on Instagram. Actually, three of you messaged me on Instagram asking me to review some products that came out and I purchased them. So this is like kind of off topic, off topic, but I'll just um, so I got this one that's from BYS. The it's an Australian um, makeup brand, I believe. And then I just got colorful really pretty colorful and then the highlight which I believe you can use as shadows and then the peach palette so it's like everything everything's brand new I need to do this video actually oh my gosh I have to finish up so many videos um so those yeah Brenda family dollar um quite a couple of um people messaged me like three people messaged me on instagram about um and they told me if i could check it out if i could do review and if i could do a look so i have that video also coming up i was mentioning rosa that i haven't been recording because i've been super busy but i since today i have free time i have lots of free time i'm going to catch up on all these videos so i'm going to be doing many different makeup looks today <laughs> They had a blush palette and con yeah, they did. I checked it out, but um, I'm they mostly told me about the highlight and some eyeshadow. So I just picked up those because I want to see how it works as well. Um, and yeah, but okay, guys. So let me go back to this one. So this is the nude palette. Well, it says nude, but honestly, I don't even think it's nude. And I believe this was the shimmer one. This well, it just has a number. This is palette number one. Another one that they have is number two. And these are the colors. Like I said, I wanted to go out of my comfort zone for this haul. Actually, I love bright colors. Yeah, to colorful for nude. Right? That's what I said. I was like, this is nude? Not to me. But I am going to swatch it. So I'm going to swatch it where I have the primer. Or actually, I'm going to swatch it right here because I have space right there. 
Um, let's do the Crayola palette. No, actually, I haven't. I've never heard of the Crayola palette. Is it colorful? That's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for really colorful palettes or shadows. Um, let's do, which one's calling my name? Which one's calling my name? Let's do this blue one right here because that is just calling my name. So I'm going to do it this one. Okay, so the texture is very, it's soft. It's pretty soft. Oh, okay. Colorful Crayola crowns. No, I haven't. So this is a shimmer palette. So there was a shimmer and a nude, I believe. And this is the finger swatch, which honestly, it's really pretty. And we're going to do it without primer. Why is this so hard to see? I think these are pressed like way too hard. Maybe maybe it's like those eyeshadows that you need to take off um, just the top first and then you can get it at wish. Okay, I'll definitely check that one out. Oh my gosh. You guys, my baby's being so good right now like because he knows mommy's recording. <laughs> so sweet. So they do feel chalky. So that's what fi that's finger swatch. Yeah, maybe maybe I need to wet them. Um, so let me try this again. Let me do this here and then I'll. Whoa. Okay. Wow. All right. So what you need to do is take off like the first layer of it. Well, not really the first layer, but just like scratch off part of it. And this is without a primer. So, you guys, in person, that's so pretty. That's, wow. That's really pretty. And not that much fallout. That's just me because I was, <laughs> I was swatching it. But it doesn't even have much fallout. That blue is really pretty. I really like that blue. You know what? I'm going to put some primer on. Let's put primer. Because we want to get good results. Oh, whoops. Thanks. Wow. You see, my board just fell. One sec. <laughs> okay, hold on. Kind of look. Yeah. I'll just keep it down because that way I can see him better. Oh, great. Here we go again with this. Hold on. I'm having some trouble with this again. Oh, no. What is it doing? Oh, great. Now I zoomed in again. Hold on, you guys. This, like, it's seriously just... Ugh. Oh, okay, whatever. <laughs> you guys, hold on, because this thing just like literally zoomed in. And here I go again having problems with it. <sighs> I think if I hold... Okay, there we go. Okay, that's the, I think that's like where it was, so I'm just going to stick with that. Um, okay, so the blue, I saw some messages, sorry. Let me see, let me go back. Uh, maybe you need to, yeah, maybe wetting them will work also. I'll probably do it better. Hmm. You know what, I'm going to do it with a brush. Let's, let's test out these products with the brush. So I just wet my brush, just, um, this is the E131 from AOA. And let's just, we're just gonna swatch. Okay, so, maybe it just depends like what you work with. I want my finger. So with the brush, it did not. It just, that was horrible. 
But when I did wet my finger um, and I placed it in, it looks really nice. But maybe these are just supposed to be... Okay, so when I wet it, it came out like more shiny. So that's, that's if I wet it. But then you guys know that there's also like certain colors. Wait, I know I skipped comments. There's also certain like shadows that um, work like, and then there's some that don't. So let's not give up on this palette yet. Oh, that wasn't even fallout. <laughs> okay, let's do, shall we do this one right here? Let's do this. Like it's like a burgundy red. Okay, so this one's softer to the touch. It's way softer. And it looks like it picked up a good amount. And that's how it is when I swatch it. No, 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 no. <laughs> Sorry. Oh my goodness. Let's do the swatch. Okay, so that's that's like pretty out there. Oh my gosh, why do I do this to myself? Maybe from far away. Maybe I'll catch it. Because, like, literally in person, they're out there. It's probably just because my light's too bright. Let me lower this a bit. Can you guys, like, see it good? Maybe I should do another swatch. How do I... And they're pretty healthy. The blue with white. Oh, it does. It does look like a mermaid look. I forgot who requested that look. I need to go back and see the screenshots. So that way I can shout out when I do it. Um, so this is the red. Or like burgundy -ish red. Maybe like wetting it. Let me try wetting it too. And it looks like you can depot them as well, so... Am I skipping a message? It brings water to the top. You guys, my baby fell asleep. Mm. He was already tired. It was time for his nap. Okay, so let me just go back to this. So the top one is a little bit wet, and the bottom one is wet as well, so. I think I like them better not wet because it already has that like shine to it. It's just my camera quality is not the best. I am working on getting better equipment, you guys. So, oh, okay. So it's it's staying my finger. The blue one didn't. It's pretty can I still work with them? Was, oh, okay, Brenda. Okay, that wasn't. I was like mixed up a little. I'm like, was it Brenda? I have to check because I did screenshot it um, and then I know Jenny asked for a smoky look just I oh she went off already but Jenny if you watch this um, what kind of smoky look did you want because there's many different types or just whatever smoky look I come up with and um, which other one do you guys want me to swatch should I do that purple or should I do this like white creamy I was so excited for these palettes, but I'm not too hyped about it anymore. Let's see. Shall we do... Let's do this white one right here. The creamy white-ish. You guys, but when I like swatch it, it feels so buttery. And then look at that. Jenny also said in this... Oh, yeah, yeah, she said a sunset look, so I definitely, I'll screenshot it. So this is the white, which is so pretty when I put it on my finger. But then also, like I mentioned earlier, your arm does not have the same pH as, like, your eye or your lips. So maybe it actually will work way better in the eyes. So when I do the look, I will let you guys know. If I had to continuously pack on or if it was just like a quick one, two, three and bam, we good. So here's the white one, which I'm going to swatch, which is going to be right here. 
Let's watch this. Oh my goodness. That is pretty. And that was only one swatch. Should I just like add to it? Let's just keep adding, make it longer. That is gorgeous. Wow. Do you guys see that? Okay, so this palette's definitely a, like a yes for me. Especially because I'm not just going to give up on it. I am going to work around it. And the colors are just so pretty. Makes me want to swatch more. Makes me want to swatch all of them. Okay, so I already did this white, this blue, and this one. Shall we do this like peachy orange? Cor no, like a peachy coral. Should we do this one? Because that one looks super pretty. You know what? Let's do it. My son fell asleep, so I have time. Let's do it. Oh, I don't have to put my shoes on. I'm wearing a long sleeve. I'm wearing a long sleeve the day that I have to swatch. Wow. Oh, sorry. That's the orange. That's pretty. That's really pretty. And in my mirror, I'm just looking at it and I'm like. Oh, there it goes again with the zooming out and zooming in. This is so. Let's get some lasagna. Yum. I love lasagna. What website? From JB and Eves? Whoa, now we want to. Do you guys know how to zoom out and zoom in on YouTube Live? Because it just continues doing it. And it's. This happened already three times. Oh, I think I got it. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Okay. Yay! All right, I'm starting to get the hang of this. Um, Rosa, the website was JB and Eves or JB Eves. They have real, real nice products on there. Like, that's that's beautiful. I'm loving this. That's so pretty. Alright, well, since my son fell asleep, I'm... Should I do a live swatch of the baked eyeshadows? I'm probably going to have to get off this one and then start a new one since he did fall asleep and I do have the time which yay so happy oh my goodness let me okay so then that's all those and I'm just gonna take them off because that way I can do the full on swatch that way this video won't be so long because I think it's already an hour Although I love chit chatting with you guys. But so I think I'm gonna get off and I'm gonna come back real quick though. So those of you that are watching, don't forget to do No yeah yeah, uh Brenda I will do a look. It's just that since some of you that start uh, in the beginning started watching the video, I did um say that I was going to do swatch, but because the video is already like an hour long, I'm just going to start a new live. So I'll be right back, and then after the swatch, I will do the look, and then I got to do the surprise that my honey surprised me with, and then what else did I have to do? See, sometimes I have to watch my videos again so I can remember what it is that I have to do. Did it come off? Yeah, it come off. So those of you that are watching... I will be back real quick. Just need to um, close out this one after I take this makeup off because it's just... Oh, and then you guys, um, for those of you that just entered, I know I have no makeup on. I'm sorry, but like I said, I have to record several videos after I finish these lives. And I didn't just want to have makeup on. I just wanted to stay bare-faced. It's better. So, yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay, there it's off. 
All right, you guys, so thank you so much for joining me on this live. I will be getting off of this one, and I will be starting a new one. So those of you that just came on, and those of you that have been watching, if you like to see the swatches of the JB and Eve's Princesa Wet Dry Eyeshadows, then I will be starting a new live, and I'll see you guys in that one. Thank you for watching. Bye. Mwah. And...